Okay guys, it's me and Joe Green, and I'm back, and here we go, this is mission 8 of the Call of Duty 2 Big Red Wood Let's Play, and uh, we just we just took part in Operation Husky, and now we are going to Piano Lupo, alright. Piano Lupo. That was brutal yesterday. I hate nothing. this mission. I already you, remember this one. Africa, I hate it. Found myself in front of an entire platoon of Frenchies. Took them all out, every one, by myself. That story gets more ridiculous every time you tell it. You know, you know I took hey, out that many people, though. Hey, tell them it was true. You was there. Hey, Hawk. I took out. It's true. Not now, Brooklyn. There's there's Brooklyn gloating about the numerous amount of people he killed. They need us to move up to Piano Lupo and reinforce the guys. Definitely taking the cake on that. Holding out all night. Not a lot of time. Aerial recon reports at least one division of crowd armor roll in from the north. They think it's the Herman Gehring division. Can we kick their asses back in Africa? I said not now. Speakers! We need some fire in the sky now! Get in that half track and take out those stukas! I hate this one. I can't tell you how many times I've like died trying to do this. The M1 carbine looks really weird in this. It looks like they took, honestly, it looks like they took two Swiss rolls. Painted them brown and then glued them to. Why the heck am I entering the turret from the driver door? So I got four. I got uh, four times more 50 cals here. I got a. Uh, I guess I should shoot that down. Ah, uh, yes. I'm already. Oh god, I hate this. Stupid. Uh, stupid. Yeah, I don't know. Where are you? Right there. I see, mm, I see a little late rendering. Oh, damn, so I'm going to get out of this guy. Where is this guy? Oh my god, there's two of them. You're not taking out my fuel tanks. Take that. How do you like the floor? Oh my god. Oh god, I can't hit him. Yeah. Look at you. The hills are alive with the sound of Stukas crashing into them. Bam! Sound of, mu sound of music reference success. Oh my phone! Move! Move! Where the heck? There's so many of them! Oh my god! Should I get the front Stuka? Should I get the back Stuka? Which Stuka should I take? What? What? No! Go away! You're gonna die. Your daughter's gonna be mighty sad. Oh, Look at that. That would kill me. I think I was dead right there. This is the w I remember this mission. This one's just bad in every single way, and it's so long too. It's such a Keep long fine. mission. Uh, you. You can hear this thing. If you can hear this thing, by the way, it's really cool. Hey, hey! That just killed 20 million people right there. I why why are you giving me this many stupid to shoot? Stop it! This guy thinks he can actually do something. You can't hit us. Ah, uh, your crusade is short lived, my friend. Trust me, I've seen what Indiana Jones does to you, and that just killed a bazillion people right there too. Indie booby twaps. This thing literally sounds like a massaging machine. So just advice for anybody who uh, it's too cheap to buy one of those things for a dollar. Play Call of Duty 2 and then just hold down the trigger. There you go. Should have one of these at Brookstone, man. I don't know if anybody else has Brookstone in a mall. It's such a mall store, but uh, it's like this 
weird store and they sell like the most. Oh my god, I can't. Ow. I'm too old for this shit, man. But, um, it's this store in malls and it, it's full of like. It's basically a store full of the most pointless stuff ever. Like, seriously. None of it that anybody would really, like, ever buy. They have, like, massaging chairs. They have, like, the dumbest stuff ever. They have, like, eye homes in the shapes of cats. We gotta meet up with Hawk. That's such a cool name. Could have got a falcon. What are we doing? Oh, okay. What else do I have here? Oh, I just have an M1 carbine for now. All right. Let's do this, man. This gun was badass in World of War. But the thing that's funny is like, if you play World of War. Looks like we're heading the rest of the way on foot. There's a lot of open ground, so don't bunch up. Stay sharp. But uh, in World of War, like the sights are so much better. This is like stupid. Look at that. Look at these guys. Look how smart they are. Taking out the Italian knives. Back. What do you want? What? I remember when I first got this game, I was. I didn't know anything about guns. And it was actually this right here is my first first person shooter, like, ever. And, um. Was it? Oh, yeah, so this is my first first person shooter ever. So when I first saw this gun. Oh, let me re say that, because that, that, that did not come out right. I was like, that's really, 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 yeah. This was my first first person shooter ever. And when I first saw this gun, I'm like, oh, cool, this is a really cool looking machine gun. But I was like, oh, shit, wait a second. Yeah, this is, they made a lot of these things. They actually did make an automatic version of this, though, called an M2 carbine. Oh, my gosh. Just got. Hey, kid, catch. Catch an airplane. God damn. Alright, so this is the Carcano right here. This is what was used to take out Kennedy. Or so they say. <laughs> oh, it's time. Gather around, children. It's time for uh, conspiracy theories with me and Joe Green. No, I'm just kidding. I mean, if it. This is like. Look at this thing. How does it. Look. How does this. This can't even. What are you doing? Headshot. This thing really is inaccurate. And that's what it's known for. It's known for being the most inaccurate rifle of uh, World War II. And um, I watched the movie JFK. Now I'm not a conspiracist and I'm not going to get into that crap because frankly I don't care. I mean, I do care that Kennedy shot. He's a great man, I guess. Or he was, but. Well, some he wasn't. But uh, he. um, They, they had numerous like military expert marksmen and there are some people who are crazy shots like if you ever watch they had this uh they had this one show on history channel where they just got some of these people who are probably some of the best shots in modern times well they had some military people test out try to make the same exact shot with this very rifle and they couldn't do it this thing is just i mean it's half it's italian it's like the fiat of rifles but if you don't know anything about fiat fiats are terrible they're awful well, they used to be. It's like the old, the old Fiat's, that is. But, uh, you know, just uh, Italian cars. Oh, where's my one carbine? Where's my one carbine? Give me back. Uh, I don't want this thing. Okay. It's going to break down. But Italian cars, if you don't know, I make a lot of car references. And I'm very sorry, because I know not everybody in this world is a car person. But f Italian cars are known for being unreliable. I'll watch this. Oh, look at us, Alfredo. We have a what safe this, spot here on the bridge. The bridge. They'll never find us. Uh. It's a whole convoy. But they ain't moving. They're sitting ducks. Thunder, this is Fox. What's your status? Over. Give me a grid reference for that bridge. Get it right or those shells are going to be dropping right on top of us. Okay, guys. got to get the... Got to spot some things. Okay, this has a... <laughs> 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 that is my favorite thing now. Ah, yo, Louise, we cannot keep this uh, truck to get out of the sand. I know just to keep pushing. We will get it eventually. 
Oh, but we are trying so hard. <laughs> They're so clueless. <laughs> look at these guys. They're like, yeah, this guy's like, yeah, look at me. Yeah, I run this place. Big whoop. I think Good that's work. it. I feel bad for these suckers right here. Still trying to push that thing out. <laughs> it's just... They have no idea what's coming to them. Poor people. <laughs> okay, where are the bombs? Oh, now they're shooting. Oh, come on, to die. Oh. Look at that. I love how the tank just rolls off the bridge. All right. Um, I'm gonna wait for this bombardment to stop. Okay, wait. Yeah, we're only 11 minutes in. Alright, go on ahead, squad. Uh, Move on I'm, gonna, to the road. I'm gonna stay right here and say something real quick. Alright, guys, uh, thanks for watching part one of mission eight here. Um, part two. I'm gonna. Part two will happen. <laughs> Why the hell did I say that? It's really awkward. Part two. Uh -oh. All right, guys. Uh, stay tuned for part two.